Okay, this is the second assignment. Second one, second assign, second class assignment is using a ringed arrays. Uh, so I will add a speaker. A ringed acoustic rays is actually real time simulation of rays. Uh, apparently, to simulate on real time, you have to make a smaller number of it, and this one only shows uh, x y axis plane or x z plane only. So before doing that, I will and you, we need to add a speaker. So I'll add a speaker somewhere in the center, and then I need to move it up because this one is on the bottom. So I'll change to side view using display setting here, and then I'll uh, move it up to somewhere here. So our speaker is ready. So this is how does it look like, and then what I'm I, so this one is selected. I will just unclick the moving. So this one is selection mode I uh, switch to calculate uh, linked acoustic rays then you will see reflector 2 so I just use it as is so 0 to 360 and 90 degree this one is means that this one is actually vertical rays so let's see so now this one create vertical rays uh, let's see the side view and let's try to let's move it so I'll select it if I move it then you will see that Whenever it is moving, the right the rays is also updated on real time. So actually, this one is too much uh, sound is actually reflected here. So probably I may want to change this one a little bit, rotate a little bit backward. So I select rotate. Then this is the center, and I rotate it a little bit upward way. So actually this one is a little bit slightly better and I a little bit move it back. So actually this one is a little bit work better and probably I will move it backward so you can project more sound to front way. Okay, so this is the, uh, but it seems like there's one more, uh, okay, one more surface is here. So I'm kind of going back. Okay, so this is the acoustic rays. This, this one is the second class assignment. Third assignment is very simple. So this one is actually showing only showing horizontal way, which is vertical way. And we also want to test the side projector. And to do that, we have to rotate it 90 degrees. I so I will click calculate uh, linked acoustic rays. And then I'll change this one to zero degrees and OK. So now you see that this one uh, shows how this sound will work. Probably we may want to see the top view. So actually, this one is a sound ray. So this is the third assignment. Okay. So the second one, third one, is actually using a linked acoustic rays, which is actually real time check. Okay. Thank you.